Hello there, welcome back to this new tutorial video. In this video, we are going to see how to show bubbles on map in Power BI. So first of all, what we will do is, from the visualization pane, we have this visual called maps. So, I will just click on this map and let me resize it properly. So after resizing it, we can see that in order to fill it, we are having location, legends, latitude, longitude and bubble size so first of all what i will do is in location i will add the states so in order stable i'm having this column state or province i will just drag and drop it over here okay so after dropping this field you can see that it is telling to enable this map feature so in order to enable it what we have to do is we have to click on this file button and then you have to go to options and settings. After that, you have to click on options. And under global, you have this security option over here. And here you have the map and field map visual. You just have to check it and click on OK. Since we have added the state and province in location, what I will do is I will add sales amount in bubble size. So for that, I'm having this sales field already over here. I will just drag and drop it up. So you can see that it has automatically identified the location from this state and province call. If you want, you can also add latitude and longitude if you are having that in your table. That can also help. And here we can see that for every state, a different bubble size has been indicated. And from here, we can easily identify that the state of California has done the most number of sales, followed by New York, then followed by Illinois, then by Washington. You can also explore the formatting options which are available over here. You can go to map settings and you have this style option over here. So you have this different style which you can choose according to your wish. You have the aerial one. This is the dark one. This is the light theme. This is the gray scale. And last one is the road. And you also have the controls. So if you want to auto zoom to the particular location, you can have it. You can also have zoom buttons on this. So you can have this plus and the minus sign over here. So you can use this as well. You also have other formatting options below. In the bubbles, you have the settings by which you can optimize the bubble according to your wish. You can optimize the size. Currently, it is selected for minus 10. You can optimize it according to your will. You also have the color which you can change accordingly. You have the data labels if you want to on it. And you also have the heat map. So, these are the different formatting options for the bubble chart which you can explore accordingly. So in this way we can show bubbles on map in any chart in Power BI. I hope you find this video very useful and helpful. If yes, do like this video and subscribe to my channel and, and stay tuned for more such videos. Thank you very much for watching the video.